Uh, 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 I'm really. I've got a cold. <laughs> I could just man up. I've got cold, got spots, not good. Anyway, I want to talk about corn. Uh, for those of you who don't know, corn is a bacterial growth, um, a fungus almost, that makes, uh, that vegetarians in the past have used as an alternative for, for minced uh, beef. Um, so, you know, instead of mince in spaghetti, you have corn. Um, now, corn have recently realised that they have got an, a limited market and in an attempt to expand their market, they've gone into, um, they're trying to access the general market outside of vegetarians as, uh, by marketing corn as a low-fat alternative to beef. Now, the way they've done this is on their uh, TV advert, they've said, oh, are you trying to lose weight and you can't have any of your favourite recipes? And then it starts listing them. And is a woman holding a large book. I'll, I'll do the book with this hand and use this hand to fill. Da 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 da. You didn't need that. And it, it starts off with a hundred recipes. So this woman knows a hundred recipes in a recipe book. And she goes, Well, you can't have your favourite meals like spaghetti bolognese. And it goes, uh, To about 84 meals. Or shepherd's pie. Or chili con carne. Or that one other dish. Or lasagna. And by the time. It said those four meals, the book has gone down from 100 meals to like 14. Now, I don't know how many different ways she has spaghetti bolognese, but there's no way she can have spaghetti bolognese 16 different ways and still include the mints in every single one of them. Because that's ridiculous. There's, there, there is no way that can happen. It's an impossibility. And so... Basically, what Corn are trying to say is, of the f of the four meals you eat using mince, and I doubt you'd have them all on the same week, because otherwise you're a dull human being. We can make them low fat. So when it says, "Oh, if you cut mince out your diet, you go from a hundred meals to fourteen, no, you're lying. You're wrong. You're not. That's not true. You go from a hundred. If she does know a hundred recipes, I don't know. Her. Well, I'm sure you could come up with slight variations, but realistically, I cook at about. 20 things, I'd say 20, 20 max, 20 things that are just, you know, the things that I cook regularly and eat and things, and, well, the woman who knows 100, if she knew 100, four less, which would put her at 96, not 14, that's surely not a massive problem, is it? She's still got 96 other recipes to call on in her repertoire. I don't know, it's just a very ridiculous thing. I, 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 I hate when advertising does this. It literally says four, four recipes and then it reduces the number by like 86. Ugh. And at the end it goes, well finally you've got corn and then the recipe book grows again. You know what else grows? My desire to commit suicide. That's a bit strong. I would never eat corn anyway. It's just fungus. It's like eating someone's foot growth. It's not like that. Anyway, bye.